Hi everybody, Mike St. Tabor here, also known as Precise26 from Traders-Circle.com. Right now, I'm looking at the Great Britain Pound US dollar on the daily chart. And if you've been following my analysis on this, there hasn't been one recently. However, nothing has really changed. It is still a mid to long term bullish trend. It's making higher highs and higher lows. And the strategy was always to buy on the dips and breaks. So I'm going to look at the daily chart here and just give an update that we have held our our key support very nicely. Um, the RVI appears to be holding key support pretty nicely as well. So that that's good. We're, we're holding support. But there is one key difference here that is different. And what that is, is we have the moving average right here, which I believe is the, oh, that's the 400 moving average. Not sure why I have that there. I don't normally use that, but to see price go above it is awesome. That's amazing. That's definitely showing more strength. If we, um, if we go back in time here, I'm just gonna remove auto scroll, go back in time, we can see usually not when it's going sideways, but when it's going up and down, when it's up, that's usually on the bottom, and when it's down, it's usually on the top. So it's fairly accurate, not perfect, fairly accurate. So we'll see how that turns out. It's, it's definitely coinciding with my thoughts of bull. Um, the, the 100 moving average has not crossed with it yet so we'll wait for that um, again I don't normally go by this 400 moving average I'm just gonna change that to the 100 moving average and I'm going to put this one oh that disappeared okay don't worry about that anyhow the 50 moving average is is well below everything's good it's sloped up we're good for the bull so how do we turn this to a trade well let's take a look let's go to the four hour chart and we can see our soft support area here. So we definitely have some more room for bear here, but we are being stopped by the 50 or the 100 moving average here. So we're gonna keep an eye on that. I, I, I'm not sure if it's gonna break that or not. The, uh, the RVI is definitely showing some strength. So I like to see that some good strength here hopefully we can break up past here and continue on up which I'm sure we will sooner or later I don't know for sure that is our break point right there and our soft break point right here and we can never forget that there's always going to be this resistance right at the top too so Basically, what we're looking for is a break of this line, a break of this line, or a break of that line. It depends on your risk appetite. I suspect we might go down a little more, so watch out for that. But if we don't and this line breaks, it wouldn't be unheard of to get in off of this line's break because this is a bull trend. We we don't need key breaks. We, we just expect it to go bull, keep expecting it to go bull. Every time you go with the trend, you're going to be right every single time except for the last time. So let's just continue with that thought and continue with the bull and get in on the breaks here, here, and here. And our target area remains the same, is right up here on our very key resistance at approximately 1.50. Anyhow, uh, I think that's all I can say about the Great Britain Pound US dollar. It's definitely looking great for the bulls very soon. So don't miss this move. Enjoy the profits. And if you like this video, please like, subscribe, and share. Good luck and have a great day.